My lord, my efforts to locate SIS agent Folleran have finally paid off. There is a small window of opportunity to confront him. I can handle the matter personally. Permission to intercept and bring him down. There's no time to waste. He must finally be stopped. I appreciate your decisiveness, my lord. The Empire will finally be served. I'll return shortly. My lord, I'm back from my mission. I'm pleased to report Agent Voleran's decade of espionage has been brought to an end. It is a great day for the Empire. Tell me you took great joy in ending the spy's life. When he realized he was exposed, Voleran surrendered to me. I took him into custody. Thank you for allowing me to pursue this, my lord. You could drop the stoic soldier routine when we're in private. Show me a little attention. I'm not sure what you mean. Don't tell me I'm not your type. Indeed, my lord, you are not a type at all. I dare say you are a wholly unique woman. But my work demands complete concentration, and I... Well, I'm not used to juggling business with pleasure. No lame excuses or explanations. If you're not interested, just say so. Now, let's get back to our duties. By all means, my lord. You could drop the stoic soldier routine when we're in private. Show me a little attention. I'm not sure what you mean. You and I could help each other unwind, reduce stress, live a little. I'm flattered, my lord. But my work demands complete concentration, and I... Well, I'm not used to juggling business with pleasure. It's time to diversify, Captain. Now, let's get back to our duties. My lord, I'd appreciate it if you could speak with Vet. Ask her not to disturb me when I'm working. Aren't you supposed to run this ship, Captain? And the crew? She's not wired for military precision. And there's no filter on that Twi'lek mouth. When I was tracking down Agent Voleran, she must have overheard me refer to Moff Broisk. And now she persistently pesters me about him. She keeps slipping his name nonsensically into conversations just to annoy me. So she won't stop until I tell her why I hate the man. Red never ceases to amuse me. I hope you won't encourage her, my lord. It's neither appropriate nor in the Empire's interest to discuss the matter with non-military personnel. Besides, knowing her, the details of Broisk's collapse at Druckenwell and his and my subsequent conflict would only give her more fodder. You have my permission to handle her severely if you have to, Quinn. I understand. It is my responsibility. I will discipline her until she desists, my lord. <laughs>